It is haunting video of an 18-year-old making his first parachute jump while his mother watched. His chute never opened. Now a judge has found the owner of the skydiving school negligent to the tune of $40 million. Tyler Turner was thrilled to go skydiving. Fighting back nerves, the 18-year-old taped this video minutes before heading into the air. My name is Tyler Turner. What are you doing here? I am going to jump out of a plane. <laughs> it's your first time. First time indeed. His mom, Francine, was there to see him off. That's my mom over there. Hello. Very loving mom. Done a lot for me in my life. Hope more that she'll help me with more of my life because I want to make it. <laughs> okay, we're going to make it. Here he is as he makes the big jump. Tragically, the parachute never opened. Tyler plummeted 13,000 feet to his death, attached to his tandem instructor, who was not certified and was also killed. I saw the ambulances and um, sheriffs and police, uh, fire engine, all that stuff was in the distance. And I could see all the lights going. I thought, oh my gosh, my son is hurt. You know, we got to get him to the hospital. Since the 1980s, the skydiving company in Lodi, California, reportedly has been linked to 20 other deaths. Were you shocked to hear how many other fatalities there had been there? Absolutely. I was. Tyler had a bright future ahead of him. He was looking forward to starting college with a full scholarship to study biomedical engineering. He was an amazing kid. He was definitely the most um, well-behaved out of all of us. He tried the hardest in school, for sure. He just really enjoyed life all around. The death happened in 2016, but the video has just been released after a judge awarded the family $40 million. Paul Vanderwald represents the Turner family. He says this was not your normal skydive operation. It wasn't run like a commercial enterprise. It was, it was more run like a bunch of people just out for fun on the weekend and they, they happened to be skydivers. There must be some satisfaction that you won against this company. It's satisfying knowing that we were able to do something. We were able to get some justice for our son. Family says they plan to use the money from the lawsuit to start a scholarship in honor of Tyler, who was a straight-A student.